The better the foods taste, the higher the chance that they're high cholesterol foods. This is one of the ironies of life. Again, it's not only one of the ironies of life, but one of the tragedies of life as well, the better it tastes, the more cholesterol it seems to contain. If you've been told to reduce the high cholesterol foods, it's a small comfort you're not alone. To start with, you should know that there are two main nutrients in the foods you eat that make your cholesterol high. The high cholesterol foods contain saturated fat, a type of fat found mostly in animal products, and cholesterol, which comes from animals as well. Saturated fats raise your LDL, bad, cholesterol level more than anything else in the diet. Eating too much saturated fat is the main reason for high cholesterol levels and a high rate of heart attacks. It makes sense that reducing the amount of saturated fat you eat is a very important step in reducing your cholesterol levels. If you stop and completely you don't miss anything, except the taste, since your body makes all the cholesterol you need. As such, it is not necessary to take in any additional cholesterol from the foods you eat. You must be aware of cholesterol-free foods, because cholesterol coming from foods, or dietary cholesterol, is hardly as harmful as the amount of saturated fats in your food. You can call them foods that cause high cholesterol, or high cholesterol foods, but in reality it is not the cholesterol content that makes them harmful. It is the fat, or better the saturated fats, which come mainly from meats, nuts and dairy foods, which causes the liver to produce more harmful cholesterol. The liver produces four times the amount of cholesterol from our diets. This makes saturated fat much more harmful than dietary cholesterol and renders dietary cholesterol as quite as negligible factor for your high cholesterol levels or cardiovascular disease risk factor. For example, coconut oil may be cholesterol free but is highly saturated and more dangerous than seafood as it causes the liver to produce more harmful cholesterol. Saturated fat also raises triglyceride levels and thickens the blood. Seafood, on the other hand, contains cholesterol, but also that protective polyunsaturated fats that cause the liver to produce less harmful cholesterol and more protective HDL cholesterol. That's why, rather than worry about high cholesterol foods, you should pay attention to foods high in saturated fats. The phrase high cholesterol foods is somehow not correct. What you should pay attention to, is foods high in saturated fats, or foods high in triglycerides, since triglycerides make up 95% of all the fats we eat. Whenever you read high cholesterol foods which is mentioned often in this video, it means foods high in triglycerides or saturated fats. High cholesterol foods are mainly found in all animals and animal products, for example, egg yolks, meat, poultry, fish and higher fat milk products. In addition, beware of processed and prepared foods. Although convenient, they are very high cholesterol foods as well as high in saturated fats. Cookies, pastries, and muffins are as well, part of high cholesterol foods family and contain high amounts of fat. You should limit the intake of all these high cholesterol foods. And, always pay attention to food package labels to check fat and cholesterol levels. Keep in mind the following when these labels say. Pound cholesterol free it means less than 2 mg mg cholesterol and 2 grams or less fat. Pound low cholesterol means 20 mgs or less cholesterol and 2 grams or less saturated fat. Pound fat free means less than gram fat. Pound low fat means 3 grams or less fat. Pound reduced fat means at least 25% less fat than other brands of same food. Knowing what are high cholesterol foods and limiting their intake does not guarantee lower cholesterol levels. You might want to consider other methods of lowering cholesterol such as exercise, increase of fiber intake, vegetables, or usage of proven supplements that lower cholesterol. While there are drugs that successfully lower cholesterol, their side effects would make them undesirable for your body. 
Instead try natural methods which you can find in various websites and reports. To find out more about lowering cholesterol naturally get your free cholesterol lowering secrets report. The internet's most downloaded report for lowering cholesterol naturally at www.all-lowering-cholesterol.com slash cholesterol-report.html Why oh you will discover minus three different ways to lower cholesterol naturally. The single food you eat every time in a fast food restaurant that stuffs you with fats that shoot your cholesterol levels sky high and more.